periodically pause this video when necessary. In short, we begin by determining the eigenvalues by setting the determinant of the matrix a minus lambda i to zero. This produces a polynomial equation for lambda called the characteristic equation. Here, lambda squared minus 5 lambda plus 6 equals zero. The solutions to the characteristic equation are the eigenvalues themselves, in this case 2 and 3. To find the eigenvectors, substitute each eigenvalue into the linear system a minus lambda i times v. Solving for v produces a line of solutions in the direction of minus 2, 1 and minus 1, 1, respectively. The image of any vector on one of these green lines remains on that line. As another example is demonstrated here, allow me to share some useful tidbits. Because setting the determinant of a minus lambda i to zero always produces a polynomial equation to solve, eigenvalue computation is considered equivalent to finding roots of polynomials. Also, the degree of the characteristic polynomial of an n by n matrix is always n. In this case, n is 2. And we know from algebra that an nth degree polynomial will have n complex roots when counting multiplicity. For a more expanded look at the 2 by 2 case, consider watching my video, Eigenvalue Cases Illustrated.